Back. Thanks for staying up late with us. Grant Lounge celebrating the Allman Brothers Band Friday night. The 48th anniversary for Grant Lounge, the 50th anniversary of the formation of the Allman Brothers Band. Sabrina Burst tells us how the lounge paid tribute to the brothers. Grant's Lounge hosted an art show Friday. Some pieces showcase the Allman Brothers Band. Artist Johnny Mollica says he did poster work for them in 1999. They've been an inspiration for me uh, artistically my whole life, really. I listen to their, their music, I make my art. So it, it's, uh, you know, some, something about their music comes out visually in what I'm painting. Photographers like Kirk West snap photos of Greg Allman that hang on the walls. Kirk knew the band well, documenting the musicians as they rocked out on the stages in the 70s and 80s. He and his wife lived at the famous home on Vineville Avenue before it became the big house. Uh, Kirk has had a wonderful career. Um, obviously, we're proud of the big house and the attraction that it has become. And other longtime friends of Greg Allman, like Chank Middleton, also remembered him Friday. Middleton posted this photo of his newly laid tombstone. Malika says Grant's Lounge was the perfect location to combine music and art to celebrate the 50th anniversary of the Allman Brothers Band and Grant's 48th anniversary in Macon. The young guys coming up to play here at Grant's, they all know the Allman Brothers songbook. They're great players. They're they, they were raised on that stuff. Yanrico Scott says he's played the drums with the band before and done some artwork for members. It's a 22-inch drum head that I, that I, uh, I did for Greg for, and his wife Stacy. The art show is free all weekend starting at 11 a.m. Saturday. Artist Michael Pierce has clothing pieces in the show inspired by the band. I have a friend in Maine who just built this Eat a Peach guitar, which is over at the big house now. In Macon, Sabrina Burst, 13 WMAZ News. Malika says some local bands also performed at Grant's Lounge tonight with a few of their songs dedicated to the band.